Inflation taking a bite out of the restaurant industry. While big chains and independent restaurants have access to better deals because of their sizes, mom and pop establishments have been forced to reevaluate their strengths and weaknesses to juggle this economic climate. News 19's Lindsay Smith paid a visit to Two Chicks Cafe and Food Truck in Hazel Green, where the owner says inflation is taking some of their profit. Experts say inflation is at an all time high and mom and pop businesses like two chicks on a roll here in Hazel Green are working day in and day out to keep their business alive. I am out of fried green tomatoes, but I've got every one of the other sides. Robbie Norman and her sister Deborah first opened two chicks as a food truck back in October 2019. The COVID-19 pandemic hit in February, forcing the two sisters to deliver the food to members in the community. Once everything opened back up that next October, it all just, you know, we're back to where we started from. Um, but by that time, we had already moved into um, a permanent location. A catering, food truck, and cafe service. That's what their business looks like today. Right now, the food truck is really what keeps us in business. That's where our money is at. Except right now it's in the catering with the holidays and whatnot. In the last year and a half, Robbie tells me their cost of goods has gone up about 30%, causing the establishment to change their business hours, take some items off the menu, and go up on their prices. We have went up on our prices one time. We don't want to go up on our prices because, you know, then people will not come in and we're already struggling to get customers in. And now it's the holidays and it's the winter time. The winter time we struggle anyway because we can't take the food truck out. Robbie says she worries about the future of their business if the economic climate stays as it is right now. We do whatever it takes to make that money and, and to, to make it happen. And so we're hoping that everything is going to be good and but that's all we can go on is a hope and a prayer. Reporting in Hazel Green, Lindsay Smith, News 19. Now the Biden administration says they are seeing initial signs that inflation is coming down. A spokesperson cited that the October consumer price index showed moderation in inflation, as did the October producer price index released last week.